For this example, we have y equals negative 2x plus 9. So please write that on your paper. Circle the plus and the 9. That is our y-intercept. So here, I'm going to circle plus 9. This is our y-intercept. Write the word dot because that's where you're going to place your dot. Remember, this is slope. Slope is a fraction. That means you have one number at the top, and you always have this imaginary one at the bottom. So next to negative 2, because since it's negative, you're still going to write the word up. It doesn't matter if it's positive or negative. The numerator is always going to go up. Because it's negative, view, think of this as a little arrow pointing to the left. And this is going to tell you to go 1 to the left. So you should have dot at 9, go up and to the left since that's negative. So let's go ahead and put our dot at positive 9. And then the 2, we need to go up 2. And as you can see, we cannot go up two lines because there, there's no more numbers. So go back to your slope-intercept form equation. And you have to cross out both words and do the total opposite. So the opposite of up is down. The opposite of left is right. So instead of going up and left, we have to go down and right since there are no more numbers. So down to one to the right. So I'm going to go down to one, two, and then one to the right, put a dot. The only reason I went down is because there were no more numbers to go up. That's the only reason that you would go down. I hit submit and the answer 